we received an invitation. And I want to say respectfully that this is no personal disparagement to the organizers or to Ms. Kim Simplis Barrow. But when we looked at all of the issues challenging the women of Belize today, we felt that in good conscience, we could not just go out there and join a rah -ra rally. We felt that it is absolutely too important. The issues of women are too important to trivialize it in terms of our participation in what we consider to be something that is not real and something that is more of a smoke screen than something that is going to benefit the Belizean people. For example, I want to say to you that we have learned that the budget for this event is over $270,000. We cannot in good conscience support that kind of public expenditure out of taxpayers' money, bring women into Belize City, have them put on an orange T-shirt, give them a plate of food and listen to, to, um, to talks and rah-rah, and, and, um, and, 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 and then they will go back to Toledo. They will go back to Cayo and the North and the Keys and face the same reality face the same reality. We have to look at everything from not a partisan political point of view, but the point of view of what is the UDP government doing for women. And our answer, when we really look at it, is a big fat zero. So why bring out people to a rah -ra rally and then they will go back to their same reality. The budget is not over $270,000 for this one event. The budget is over $270,000, but it's premised on a year-long series of activities. The majority of our money came from the Oak Foundation, and we've had a lot of great corporate sponsors, along with other sponsors that we've written proposals to, to fund this event. It is by no means public money. Could you tell us what extent of that money, what amount, because we assume there was some government of Belize funding, either through the Ministry of Human Development. Was there any funding at all from the government of Belize? The government of Belize and the Ministry of Education, I must say, has assisted us in some transportation and not in money. You would know the Ministry of Education run school buses. And so it's from that, it's from that angle. And, it, and that is some of the help that we're getting.